A potential COVID outbreak at a New Mexico juvenile detention center has been stopped thanks to a unique program launched by the state. News 13's Brady Wakayama explains. Fighting COVID from below the ground, a program by the state designed to stop outbreaks before they start appears to be working. Early last month, the Environment Department launched a COVID-19 wastewater surveillance program, ultimately testing the sewage from jails, prisons, and CYFD group living facilities. Individuals who are infected with COVID, um, when they go to the bathroom, the virus can be detected in their feces. And that's regardless of if they're symptomatic or not. It also can be detected before they are infectious. Late last month, they got a hit. The virus was detected in the wastewater at the J. Paul Taylor Juvenile Detention Center in Las Cruces. The Environment Department immediately notified the facility and they were able to test more than 100 clients and staff. Identify where the virus is at and be sure that we then uh, take the appropriate measures to isolate those individuals um, to contain any spread that could occur. Turns out there was an asymptomatic person working at the facility, and that person was able to isolate, preventing a massive outbreak there. We focused on these congregate facilities because you know, once COVID gets in, it's so hard to control, you know, with people, um, with residents and staff working and living so closely together. At the Southern New Mexico Correctional Facility near Las Cruces, they were able to detect traces of the virus spiking from December 17th to the 23rd. They informed the facility of the trend, which resulted in more testing and people going into quarantine. By the 28th, numbers started to go back down. Officials say this is a great tool in the fight against the pandemic. The program really serves as um, an early warning system. Brady Wakayama, KRQE, News 13. The Environment Department is funding this program through the Federal CARES Act and hopes to expand it throughout the state.